Eric Miranda and Jeffrey Contreras are guilty of the murder of Bowen and Bowen manager, 57-year-old Sean Menzies. Menzies was smoking a cigarette outside of his house on Lancaster Street in Belize City when he was shot dead on November 18, 2018. In the subsequent trial over his murder, one of the main witnesses, Iran Bosco Jones, disappeared and was later discovered murdered and buried in a shallow grave in Biscayne Village in June. He had received death threats after he gave testimony in the trial for the prosecution. His mother had told News 5 that Jones felt that he was going to be killed. They don't have no witness protection, Marianne. That, that just want, want, want jokes. That's the joke of the day. No witness protection they don't have. I thought so until with the case, that's the one that he mentioned that he was fearing for his life. After the case was over, he said, Mommy, I won't live to see my child. He said, please make sure that you know, help my girlfriend in a, any way possible because he knew it. While the trial was ongoing, prosecutors had staged a sick-out in direct response to threats that were received in carrying out their duties. The prosecutor in this case was one of those who had also received threats. Incidentally, another witness had changed his story when he took the witness stand. But during the handing down of the verdict, Justice Ricardo O'Neill Sancroft made it known that there was sufficient evidence from the other remaining witnesses to rely on. I am satisfied that the prosecution has proven beyond a reasonable doubt that both of you killed Menzies. Hence, why I find you both guilty of murder, Sancroft said when he addressed the two convicts today. And although he was murdered, Jones's testimony helped to seal today's guilty verdict. Jones, in his testimony, told the court that he saw the two fleeing suspects, Miranda and Contreras, where one of them was seen handing back what appeared to be a gun to the other before running off from the scene of the murder. He identified the two fleeing men as persons he knew by aliases Soldi or Blocker and the other as Belly. Justice Sancroft found that identification was an important factor in the trial against the men and one that he looked carefully at. In his view, all parties referring to Jones, Miranda and Contreras all knew each other well. Miranda and Contreras were represented by attorneys Darrell Bradley and Arthur Saldiver, but neither of them was present in court today. However, attorney Kimberly Wallace of Lavender Chambers substituted for the attorneys. Justice Sancroft has reserved sentencing upon Contreras and Miranda for December 7th. Reporting for News 5, I'm Marion Ali.